A lot of people are calling me, texting me, um, you know, asking me a lot of questions uh, about my Diddy post. And, and number one question is, Diddy, go. Uh, and the only way I know how to answer this is in... What's up, everybody? This is the world famous Ed Lover, and you are watching Forgotten Kings TV. That's right. Forgotten Kings TV. Come on, son. I'm snitching. I'm snitching in the kitchen. Diddy. Gotta tell on him. He he tried it on me. So I know it's true. I was married, my ex-wife. Uh uh I got a phone call in the middle of the night, about two thirty in the morning. It's Diddy. It was my wife says, pick up the phone. It was an unknown number. Unknown number. Pick up the phone. What bitch is calling? Who's calling you? Picked up the phone. It was Diddy. And he said, hey, man, we didn't see what the BET Awards. We didn't see what the BET Awards. Uh, you know, what you doing? I'm, like, I'm in bed with my wife. He said, I, uh, I'm at the Beverly Hills Hilton, uh, the Beverly Hills Hotel. I said, oh, I said, what's up? I said, who over there? He said, just me. Happy Sunday, y'all. Uh, hoping you guys are having a wonderful Sunday. Praying God bless you, God keep you. So a lot of people are calling me, texting me, um, you know, asking me a lot of questions uh, about my Diddy post. And, and number one question is, Diddy, go. Uh, and the only way I know how to answer this is in the Dave Chappelle voice because when Dave says it, people listen. Goes crazy, it's ridiculous. What I look like going to Diddy's hotel room in the middle of the night. Anything's possible. Kevin Garnett said it when they won the championship. He said anything's possible. And I wasn't playing those games. <laughs> wasn't playing those games. Mm mm. Mm mm. We the knockout kings of comedy. This your boy, Reggie Curl, you know what I'm saying? This is my cousin, Squirrel Joe, you know what I'm saying? He's coming around. No, I know me old <laughs> from the lambskin condoms. I ain't even want my man to eat my because I eat meat from Aldi's. The fuck wrong with you? Aldi's, you shouldn't eat this. We don't know what the fuck that meat is. Prison. That's not the, the part about it. The, the part about it is he had the audacity to ask me why I ain't help him. I said, ain't no point of both of us getting. I step up, look him right in his eyes. He go to pat me down. $20, homeboy. I'm like, <laughs> no, sir. Punchline, punchline, punchline. Get out of the car. Give me a second.